Read all about it. Last October, Taiwan-based Malaysian crooner Nicholas Teo was warded in hospital after he was found to be suffering from liver inflammation. Following his doctor's advice, he took a two-month break. During his hiatus, the Mandarin pop singer chalked up almost half a million ringgit, or close to two hundred and six thousand Singapore dollars, in debt after rejecting many local, Taiwan, and China performances. Fast forward to two months later, he is now back in the scene, refreshed and ready to rumble. 之前还是在宣传我的新专辑嘛，《沉默的瞬间》，那时候是啊、呃、六六七月左右发的，所以后来是十月。十一月份、十一月左右，然后就开始身体出现一些状况，然后就休息，一直到十二月底又开始工作，然后所以现在非常健康。The Prince of Ballads, as Nicholas Teo was known after releasing his album The Moment of Silence last June, made a special appearance in Singapore to promote StarHub's new service Karaoke. He tells Razor TV what he's been up to after returning from his break. Now, is to do a lot of events, like for example, shows and activities, and then get rid of some of the old debt. Because at that time, suddenly, suddenly, you have to get rid of a lot of work. So, some of it is now starting to go to the time of the event. Then, is to start to prepare for the new album. Then, I hope to be able to let you hear my new album soon. Despite having withdrawn himself from the public eye for two months, Nicholas is confident of keeping his fan base. 还好哎，我觉得两个月前其实也没有很长了。那呃，之前发专辑也来新加坡宣传，那这一趟再来，刚好是做。这样卡拉 OK 这样一个活动，然后也是可以趁这个机会见见我的歌迷，所以我没有想太多，他们也很开心啊，所以我也很开心，就是可以看到大家，然后唱给大家听。我其实也没有，我我其实只是没有出来跟大家见面，跟做一些活动。但是我那两个月，我也是用透过，呃，比如说我的一些 blog， 然后我的一些官网跟歌迷联络，然后我写了很多的。拍了很多照片呐、啊，然后写了很多的一些心情跟大家分享，所以其实大家没有没有感觉是离开这样子的。Well, he may have taken the long rest to recuperate from liver inflammation specifically. Did stress have any part to play in it? Find out in the next clip.